This father gifts his daughter a secret room, and what she finds inside makes her day. Parents. As and when they come to know that they're expecting, they're on cloud nine. Probably no one else can feel the emotions that they're going through. They'd begin with all kinds of preparation. Right from buying new clothes, stuffed toys, to cute little accessories, they'll do it all. Some would even begin designing a room for the little one. An unborn baby can gift you so much joy that you feel like reciprocating it with all you can. This man gifts his daughter a secret room and you'll be surprised to know what she finds inside. A couple from England were living a typical married life and followed the usual chore. They were having a stable life until the day they found out they were going to be parents. The news of their expecting bought an altogether new joy in their lives. It instantly spread happiness around them. They started looking up to the next day, followed by months. They couldn't wait for their baby's arrival. The excited would-be parents began with the preparations. With every passing month, the parents-to-be would put their preparations on an elevator. They bought toys, baby cradle, water sippers and diapers, baby pram and whatnot. Amidst all this, there was something unique which the father wished to do for his unborn child. He wanted it to become something different, something that no one ever did before. But what could it be was still a question. How can it be so special that a newborn could be amazed at it? What this father plans for his baby will amaze you. A secret room. Yeah, you heard that right. Nothing would have been more unique than this, isn't it? Gifting your newborn a secret room is something probably none will ever think of. Well, this father just turns a space in his home into a secret room to gift it to his child. How a baby who's barely born can use this gift? Why does the father do that? What resides in that space? Soon the nine months of the pregnancy phase passed. The couple gave birth to a baby girl, a daughter something they earnestly desired. Their happiness knew no boundaries. The couple gave all the love and nourishment to the infant. But when were they going to give her the gift they'd been preparing since the day they discovered their pregnancy? The father decided that he'd wait until the day his daughter turned six years. He wished to gift her the secret room as a birthday present. Probably she'd be able to use it then. As time flew by, the baby girl marks the development from an infant to a toddler and to a preschooler. She was turning into an inquisitive little girl. She would question and inquire about everything to her parents. Her curiosity about the world made her an interesting being. The father thought that instead of presenting her the secret room in an easy manner, he'd arrange a treasure hunt for his ever-curious daughter. The father took hints from various fictions and started with his work to create a treasure hunt for his daughter. He made an interesting map of the location where the secret room was situated in his house. After hours of hard work, finally a map though quite simple, was created. The father made use of easy landmarks on the map so that the daughter could easily locate the hidden room. Finally, it was the daughter's sixth birthday. The time was around the corner when the ever-hidden secret room would come to be disclosed. The family together played hide-and-seek that day. The adults hid in different corners of the house, and the birthday girl decides to hide in her favorite spot, her grandmother's trunk. Since childhood days, the girl would hide in this old trunk full of junk. But this time she finds something suspicious in this trunk. What was this unknown? While hiding in the trunk, the girl finds a coarse substance. She retouches it to realize as to what exactly it was. She was amazed to find a scroll. It was a map to something little known. Something similar to a treasure hunt. This was not the first time that the girl was hiding in this trunk. She'd been here many times. She'd unwrap everything present in that trunk. Due to this habit of hers, the father intentionally hides the map of the treasure in this trunk. The girl started cooking possibilities of what could be there in the room in the map promises. A box full of chocolate and candies? Or maybe a room stuffed with toys? Maybe it's an entire new Barbie world. Can I find Minnie Mouse over there? Or maybe Donald Duck? A treasure chest full of gold coins, just like they find in storybooks? Or would it be a haunted place which is abandoned for years? Quite obvious of her nature, the girl got really excited to find a treasure hunt in her home. She was over the moon and asked her father to help her with it. She wished to find the secret room which the map promised. She, along with her father, sets in to find the room. Following the map, they reached the hallway of their home and beneath the carpet they found something interesting. 
On reaching the hallway as they stepped over the running carpet, the little girl could feel something beneath it. Even the map had some dark pink spots at the spot. The girl readily picks up the carpet from the side to find what's hiding beneath it. She was surprised to find a card lying there. It appeared to be something similar to a cue card. She reads it aloud, you're on the right path. This made the little girl's confidence on this map firm. She was getting sure that she would definitely find something in the end. Step after step, the girl and her father matched the footprints with the way of the map. The father was extremely happy to realize that his daughter was so keen to find the room which she created years ago for his child to find later. The map took the girl to her bedroom. She was surprised that the room she's been residing in since years has a treasure which she had absolutely no clue about. Where can the secret room be located that it never caught the little one's eye? The girl finally reaches to the mark on the map which shows the location of the secret room. Though the wall which the map highlighted was behind an Elmira, it couldn't calm the girl's enthusiasm. She instantly asked her father to slide the Elmira to a corner and look inside the wall behind. As the father shifted the Elmira, the girl was screaming with excitement. Finally, the moment was here when the door to the secret room will be opened. But wait, where was the door? They were surprised to find the mark, but nothing there. The father pointed, let's check for some hollowness of the wall. Maybe we'll discover something here. Both the father and his daughter started knocking the wall to hear the hollowness, if any. After carefully listening to the sounds, they could finally find the spot which made a sound other than that of the entire wall. The father had made all the needed arrangements beforehand, of course. He planned it long back. He got an electric saw and cut a small piece of a square on the wall, which sounded hollow, just as big as his daughter could crawl into. After doing that part, the father sat back along with the family and excitedly watched his daughter undoing the sheetrock to find the secret room. The girl was amazed to find a secret passage. She would shout from there, Dad, it was right here in front of our eyes, and we never saw this. It's a tunnel kind of thing, which is paving the way somewhere further. The little eyes beamed with astonishment and excitement. It was no less than a fairy tale to her. Where the little princess finds something hidden in her own palace. Little did the girl know that there was something even bigger waiting for her inside. As the girl crossed the passage, she was taken to a small room. She couldn't believe her eyes. It was an all-new space inside there, behind her Elmira. It was a room big enough for her to play around. She says to herself, the next time I'll play hide-and-seek with my friends, I'll hide here. No one will be able to find me. I'll win. Just when the girl was admiring the room, her foot touched something unusual. She immediately backed off and bent down to have a closer look at it. What she finds there will compel you to cross-check your room's walls. It was a box, an old antique box with some sculptures engraved on it. The girl admires the box carefully. She's never seen something like this before. It was all covered in dust and dirt, but all this could not stop the girl from unlocking it. The girl was already amazed at these new findings that the box holds something even more for her. The girl couldn't believe what an incredible thing she found. Seeing his daughter's expressions, the father had no heart to tell her that he himself created it for her amusement. On unlocking the box, she expected to find some huge amount of gold coins, but what she finds inside amazes her even more. The box had all sorts of knickknacks, some old currency, a few gold coins, and some antique pieces of jewelry. For a girl, these make for a big treasure. The girl shouts of excitement from inside. Hey, Dad, it's gold in here. It's a treasure chest inside. Not all those glitters were gold, but wait, some of them were pure gold. The jewelry was an authentic one. There was copper and brass coins, some bracelets and chains. The excited girl tried every piece of jewelry on her just like a grown-up. Her expression in this picture itself describes how surprised and happy she is to find one. The girl brings the treasure box outside in her bedroom where all her family members were sitting. She empties the contents of the box on the table and excitedly shows every piece on the table to everyone around. She says to her mother, See, Mom, this is a beaded chain of gold. Even the family members looked at the contents with interest as they were all seeing those after some half a decade. Seeing his daughter this happy, the father knew his work had been rewarded. All these years, he's longed to see this pleasing smile on his daughter's face. Her smile gave him immense satisfaction. He knew his gift had made his daughter's day. Her birthday undoubtedly had turned out to be special and memorable one. 
the father could no longer control his emotions and was teary-eyed. The ever-inquisitive girl rushes back to her newly discovered secret room to see if she's left behind something. She again carefully looks inside the room, admires every wall, and even knocks at them to see if there's something even more hidden behind those walls. To her utter surprise, she finds something more, right exactly at the place where she found the treasure box. What more had the father stored in this room that two years ago? Exactly at this place where the girl found the treasure box, she also found an envelope there, which she missed on the first sight. She opens the envelope in apprehension, and what she finds inside was heart-melting. In a letter, a letter from her father which was addressed to her, and what it read would even leave you teary-eyed. The letter read, Dear Princess, I hope you liked your sixth birthday. The girl was taken aback. For a moment, she could not absorb as to what she read. She continued reading further. All these years, I've been waiting to present you this secret room, and I thought your sixth birthday would be the best day to gift you this. She continued reading. Little princess, this is no treasure hunt. I planned it all long before when I learned that I would be a father soon. I wish to gift you something unique, something no one ever thought of gifting their offspring. I'm sure you love this adventure, but there's something more I'd like to tell you. The letter had something special as well. It had an advice. The father gives his daughter a wise advice regarding this treasure. He said, These knickknacks, coins, and ornaments are our ancestors. We've preserved it all for decades. I would want you to do the same. Use these for a good cause, or gift them to someone who's desperate in need of these. The girl ran to her father and gave him a tight hug. She, with teary eyes, says a heart-filled thank you to him. She says further, This is a really special gift. No toy or Barbie doll could make up this one. The father and daughter shared a special moment. The girl promises her father to make a wise use of the gift. She understands the sentiments and values her family's attached to it. She promises him to safeguard this treasure chest for as long as she could. She would also gift it to someone who's in desperate need of help and not to anyone else. What happens to the treasure chest later is a mystery. Whether the girl was able to do justice to that or not is not known. But all one can hope is that the girl would stick by her father's advice and would make a good use of the gift. She may give it to someone in desperate need of help, or maybe she too preserves it for her upcoming generations.